Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to the channel, guys. So, I've got a little something that I purchased a while back. I just haven't had time to unbox it, but here it is. So, this is for all you EDC, campers, hikers, just any type of prepper, or just someone in general that wants to take it to a beach, to a park, many different purposes and uses for this. Made by a company called Syac. And here it is. Um, this is a multifunction outdoor emergency radio. You have solar power, hand crank, weather band, flashlight, solar charge, and, ex and an internal battery. Um, I got this on Amazon, guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. $20, depending on your state, you know, plus tax. But I haven't even played with it. I saw the reviews. It uh, comes in different colors. You can get it in black, yellow, green, and red. I got it in black. So let's open it up. All right. Let's check out the packaging. So we have a, looks like just a USB type C cord. Uh, let's see. Looks like directions. Guys, and the model number is 366W. I'll put that in the description. All right, so yeah, just some regular basic instructions. You want to go over them. All right, let's check it out. So, I mean, palm of my hand, that's pretty good. You can put that in your backpack. A purse, even. It's very um, compact. So I kind of like that. Hand crank. Let's see how this works. And crank. Let's pull it out. Yeah, you can hear that. I wonder if it comes charged. Uh, power button. And volume. I haven't even tried it, so. so oh, okay. So it shows battery you see a red light so is it on now it's on so that's the loudest it gets i'll try a different station it's got fm am Okay. Wow, it gets pretty loud. Let's try the, um, if you look, it says WB, weather bands, and it gives you a description up here. Here, click it over. It gives you, so let's see if we can find a weather band. Let's get an antenna. Um... I would be real careful with that. It's one of those, if you grew up in the 80s, 70s, 80s, and early 90s, one of those cheap ones. So, I'm gonna... there we go. Wow, that works pretty good. Wow. So okay, that is pretty good. High pressure builds in over the week to four feet. A chance of showers in the morning. So that weather band works really good. And here's your. I wouldn't expect much out of that. You'd have to really leave that in the sun. So yeah, as you, it's pretty loud, and it has a flashlight, guys. It even has SOS. 
Uh, I think it says SOS. I don't know how you work it. Oh, there it is. Whoa, you got to hold it down, guys. Let's see how bright it is. Shut this. Hold on. I mean, let's see. For the price and for what it is, that will get you through the woods. That will definitely um, help you see at night. That's pretty good, actually. Not bad, actually. So, yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, as far as the SOS, guys, it's pretty loud. You hold. Oh, let me focus on here. As far as the SOS goes, you have to hold the SOS button down, which is also your flashlight button. Um, let's see. So you get your ports right right here. I don't know how many ma this is. I'll have to check on the box. But this is a cool radio. I mean, for the price point, 20 bucks, it's loud. You know, like I said, you go to the beach, hand crank it. I will say this, guys. There we go. So, right there, you can plug in, you can charge your phone. And then right here is the Type C to actually charge the internal battery. Um, yeah, I like it actually. Um, I wouldn't say it's as durable, you know, I'll take care of it and be careful with it, but any type of an emergency, you know, you're out in the woods, you got to crank it, you got to get a couple bars on your cell phone, especially with today's technology. When you get the new iPhones or even Androids, they send out an SOS signal. So even if your phone's dead, you can hand crank this and get a few bars. Let's see if we can find uh, how many mar it is. I will check in here. It says it's 501 amp. So that um, will take a while to charge a phone. So five minutes of winding gives 15 to 20 minutes of radio play at maximum volume and 1.41 hours of flashlight so almost a little over an hour for an hour and a half for the flashlight just for right here it says right here on my hand crank so yeah so if you just five minutes 15 to 20 minutes of radio play at max volume so that's pretty good let's see what it gives you for charging um, power band, solar panel lifespan, more than 25 years, when used for six hours per day. Let's see, the charging indicator will flash red when battery needs charge. It takes one to two hours for internal battery. It's 3,500 mAh. Okay. When it comes to completely charged, the battery will deliver four or five hours of radio play, depending on the sound and volume, or 18 hours of flashlight. So on a full charge, you can get 18 hours and five hours of radio play. So that's not bad, guys. But it takes one to two hours to charge, and it's only 3,500 mAh. So that's not much, but like I said, five minutes of hand cranking, Get you about 20 minutes of charge. You can probably get about three bars, four bars on your phone. In an emergency, you're good to go. You know, I would just keep hand cranking it because you're in an emergency, but that should really help you. Again, guys, that's the model, and it's made by Sayak. Well, guys, hope you enjoy the video. Um, I just want to thank all my new subscribers my old subscribers guys i love doing these videos let's keep that algorithm going give me a thumbs up and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see give me a thumbs up i really appreciate it we're getting to that 100 subscriber mark for the next giveaway who knows maybe these will maybe i'll be giving one of those away till next time guys i'm dodge and i'm out